This new discovery could revolutionize electricity and electronics by enabling efficient transmission without resistance that could enable the next technological era. And recently, there are claims being made about such a discovery. Watch this video till the end as we uncover it all. Hello and welcome back to Lux Econ. In today's video, we'll see the story of LK99, the first room temperature ambient pressure superconductor. So let's get started. A team of South Korean physicists recently made headlines when they claimed to have constructed the first room temperature ambient pressure superconductor, LK99. To realize the relevance of room temperature ambient pressure superconductors, we gotta first understand superconductivity. When electrons flow through a typical conductive material, they encounter impediments in the form of atoms, resulting in resistance and heat dissipation. However, superconductivity is a fascinating phenomenon. Electrons can pair up and flow smoothly through the material at extremely low temperatures, approaching to absolute zero, defying resistance and conducting electricity without loss. Because of this lack of resistance, energy transmission is nearly flawless. The quest for a material that can achieve superconducting at room temperature and normal air pressure has been the holy grail of superconductivity. The current claim gives up hitherto unimagined opportunities for technology and physics. The South Korean team presented their breakthrough material, LK99, which was created through a solid state reaction between linarkite, which is a lead apatite, and copper phosphide. The improved lead apatite structure of LK99 allows it to maintain and display superconductivity at room temperature and ambient pressure. Notably, LK99's superconductivity results from minute structural distortion caused by minor volume contraction caused by Cu2 plus substitution of Pb2 plus ions in the phosphate insulating network. This structural deformation results in superconducting quantum wells in the LK99 cylindrical column interface. The researchers exhibited several superconducting properties in LK99 in their preprint papers. The critical temperature of LK99 has been reported to be higher than 127 degrees Celsius, indicating that it can reach superconductivity at ambient temperature. The researchers discovered a dramatic decline in electrical resistivity around 220 degrees Celsius and near zero resistivity at 140 degrees Celsius, bolstering the assertion of superconductivity. The researchers also demonstrated the Meissner phenomenon, a characteristic of superconductivity in which LK99 displayed levitation when put on a magnet. The team of South Korean scientists who discovered LK99 had been working on the project for over 20 years. They began their research in 2003 when they were studying the properties of lead apatite. They quickly realized that lead apatite had the potential to be a superconductor, but they were unable to achieve superconductivity at room temperature and ambient pressure. Over the next two decades, the team conducted a series of experiments to try to improve the superconducting properties of lead apatite. They tried different doping agents, different synthesis methods, and different pressure conditions. They also collaborated with other scientists around the world to share their findings and get feedback. In 2023, the team finally succeeded in achieving superconductivity at room temperature and ambient pressure. They did this by doping lead apatite with copper and using a special synthesis method. The 20-year journey to discover LK99 was a long and challenging one, but the team's perseverance and dedication paid off in the end. Their discovery is a major breakthrough in the field of superconductivity, and it has the potential to revolutionize a wide range of technologies. The Revolutionary Use Case This room temperature superconductor LK99 has the potential to transform battery technology. Its usage in batteries could result in much larger energy storage capacities and faster charging periods for a variety of products, including smartphones, laptop computers, and electric cars. This would improve daily usage by offering more reliable and longer lasting power sources. The development of LK99 could be a significant quantum computing advance. Superconducting materials are critical for generating and sustaining the sensitive quantum states required for complicated calculations. 
If LK99 is shown to be a viable room temperature superconductor, it may pave the way for more accessible and practical quantum computers, allowing for faster and more powerful data processing in a variety of industries. Renewable energy sources, such as solar and wind, frequently produce power on an intermittent basis. Because of its potential as a room temperature superconductor, LK99 could be used to efficiently store excess energy at peak production times. This stored energy might subsequently be released during low energy generation periods, maintaining a steady and reliable supply of renewable energy and making it more viable to rely on clean energy sources for day-to-day -day power needs. The use of LK99 in electrical motors and propulsion systems could result in substantial transportation breakthroughs. Improved energy economy and performance could assist electric cars, airplanes, ships, and trains. EVs could have longer ranges and faster charging capabilities with LK99, making them more feasible for daily commuting and lowering carbon emissions too. The superconductor could enable maglev trains to achieve higher speeds and enhance daily commuting for passengers in metropolitan areas by minimizing energy loss during propulsion. The use of LK99 in electrical power transmission networks has the potential to drastically reduce energy losses during long distance distribution. This increased efficiency would result in lower electricity costs and a more dependable power grid, which would benefit both homes and industries in their day-to-day -day consumption of electricity. The future we envision is rapidly approaching, propelled by a wave of game-changing innovations that promise to transform the way we live, work, and interact with the world around us. So that was it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed our video. If you did, like and share the video and subscribe to Lux Econ for many more informative videos. Stay tuned as we'll be back soon with another important video. Till then, keep watching Lux Econ.